autumn olives good for? What do you use them for? Jelly. Jelly? You like autumn olive jelly? Mm -hmm. The you good stuff? One? No thanks. I'm going to talk to you today about autumn olives. Amazing autumn olive. This here you see behind me is an autumn olive bush. Um, a lot of people consider these invasive. Well, because they spread a lot. <laughs> But they have a lot of benefits too. Um, these little berries ha are high in lycopene. It helps reduce the risk of cancer. Um, and uh, they taste, now well, they're a little bitter, but they have uh, seed. It's quite large. And it's soft, kind of like a sunflower seed. It doesn't have a really hard shell. And in that seed, there's a lot of oil, um, you know, like vegetable oil. So you bite it with your teeth, and you can feel it come out. So when you process these for like jelly, a lot of times there'll be a little layer of oil on the top of the of the jelly when you get done in the jar. There's like a a layer of oil that you could pour off, but um, really healthy plant. They're beneficial for obviously for wildlife because they have food and cover. They're thick. They provide lots of cover. Um, they make really good poultry feed if you want to feed your chickens some natural feed. They're they're very nutritious. Um, high in protein because of the oils. Um, they also fix nitrogen in the soil so they're a soil builder erosion control um, there are some good ones right there take that one you see it's kind of an orangey red color we'll eat that got kind of a definitely sour some of them are sweet some of them are sour this one's one of the sour ones one of the sour ones yeah, these ones aren't quite as old as the ones over there. They get this like powdery feeling in your mouth. It's uh -huh. weird. That right there, it is not an autumn olive. It does not have spots. Do not eat those. They don't taste very good. They're poisonous. Well, they're supposed to be poisonous, but your mom ate some and didn't die, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they just taste really bad. Oh, here's something I got to show you. This, this right here, this funky looking fungus like stuff that's kind of slimy, looks like dog vomit. It's called, stuff is called dog vomit slime mold. It's actually what it's called. Google it if you don't believe me. And it's, it's not, it doesn't hurt anything. It's not dangerous. It just, whenever you have wood chips, you get this stuff. Just kind of funny looking stuff. It's all slimy and gross looking. It's like yellow, it looks dangerous. It looks it looks nasty. I don't know if I would like eat it or anything, but if you look that up, it's, it's not really a fungus. It's not really a mold. It's like something in between. It's got its own classification of. Anyway, pretty cool stuff. If you like this video, please uh, click the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more homesteading videos, more barn videos. Uh, we're going to do little projects around the farm and um, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.